Hi, thank you for joining me on the YouTube Bourbon Fool channel, and I want to show you today one of the most unique bottles I've ever seen in the marketplace. This bourbon bottle is so unique, it is one of a kind, and I want to show you all the reasons why it's one of a kind with one very special reason at the end. So please keep watching. A few months ago, I had the opportunity to visit the Green River Distillery in Owensboro, Kentucky. Now, after visiting more than 60 distilleries throughout the United States, I had never made it to Green River, which was formerly known as O.Z. Tyler. However, I made the trip and I was so very glad I did. Not only did I get to taste some very great whiskeys and bourbons, but the other great reason for going there was the ambiance. It's a historic property. And when I saw this Green River bourbon bottle, I was absolutely floored. It is so unique, and I'm going to show you the reasons why. First of all, if you go to the gift shop at the distillery, you're able to buy a presentation box. It's a nice added feature if you get the opportunity to do this. It makes a really great gift, or if you're going to keep one for a memento, it's nice to have a presentation box. And it's a very nice looking presentation box, but that's not the best reason for buying this bottle. This is one of the most unique bottles I've ever seen in the spirits industry, but specifically for the bourbon world. It is a flat front Art Deco bottle and it contains really good bourbon. But today we're not going to talk so much about the bourbon inside. We are going to talk about the bottle itself because it is one of the most unique bottles I've ever seen and it will sh do something that no other bourbon bottle does. First of all, flat front, Green River, it'll show you a little bit of the historical provenance of this location, DSP Kentucky 10 that will show you how far back distilling has been going on, on the, at this property. More importantly though, let's take a look at the bottle. The bottle has some really good graphic elements. It has a really nice label, it has a back label, and the bottle itself has five horseshoes on it. The horseshoes are a throwback to the uh, historic days of the distillery, and one of them is on the back label, uh, two of them are on the uh, throwback green tax label over the top. One is a glass embossed one right here at the front. And the other one is actually makes up the bottom of the bottle. It's very unique. It's very cool. And this bottle is one of the most beautiful bottles I've seen in a long time. Now, that's still not why this is the most unique bourbon bottle I've ever seen. So all of that makes this a really good bottle. Great location, great people. And by the way, if you have not been to Green River at Owensboro, it's worth the trip. If you get a chance to visit Green River Distillery, and I suggest you do, I think you will really enjoy it. It's a historic property. The people are great there. And there is a lot of Southern hospitality, which is so prevalent in the Kentucky bourbon world. I took a long time to get there, but it won't take me a long time to go back because now that I've been there, uh, I want to see more. The other aspect of this bottle is one that I've never seen before, and I think it's a lot of fun. And that is the opening here that is created by the glass bottom horseshoe is the perfect size for a quarter. So I could see taking this to a party or a housewarming or something like that, and this bottle becomes part of a table game. Yes, you can actually use a regular quarter, and the quarter will slide in the opening. And I could see people putting the bottle out and taking shots into the bottle and to see who, you know, it's a tabletop soccer, it's a tabletop hockey game, but it's really unique and it's a fun element of this bottle. I've never seen anything like it. I really think it's uh, really unique, and I hope you agree with me. It's a pretty darn cool bottle, 
It would be a handsome bottle on anyone's display. It would look great back here. And I think it's a lot of fun. I have had the opportunity to taste some of their product, both their current product and some of the future offerings that are gonna be coming out. And I think Green River is going to be a name to reckon with for a while in the bourbon industry. They have recently partnered with Bardstown Bourbon Company, and I think that is a great fusion of the old and new. Bardstown being the new scientific state-of-the-art distillery and Green River bringing a kind of historic old school Kentucky distilling element to the product line. I think it's really gonna be a good marriage and I can't wait to see what comes out. So if you get the chance, pick up one of these bottles. I think it'll be a lot of fun and get a chance, go see Green River Distillery in Owensboro. I think you won't be disappointed. Thank you for watching the Bourbon Fool YouTube channel. And next week, we are going to have a tasting video and review the product that's in here. The bourbon is very good and we will have a full video on that bourbon. Thank you for watching. And remember, bourbon is best experienced with friends. See you next time.